From DocuSign, I'm Robert Knight, a member of the Developer Center team. In this screencast, I'll walk you through an introduction to the API dashboard, which tracks the health of your DocuSign integrations. To follow along with this video, you'll need a DocuSign developer account. You can sign up for a free account at the link provided. The API dashboard lets you track the health of your apps in several ways. It provides detailed reports of failed API requests so you can troubleshoot issues, a 30-day graphical timeline of your successful and failed API requests for a given integration, logs of the specific API calls made for an integration, which can be filtered by time intervals and HTTP response codes, and details about failed requests that help you investigate and troubleshoot. The API dashboard shows all metrics and API requests made by your DocuSign integrations, including those calls made through our SDKs and tools. This gives you a complete view of your integration's API activity. To view your developer dashboard, go to the Apps and Keys page in your DocuSign account. On this page, you can see account information, such as your user ID, your API account ID, and the base URI for making API calls. Scrolling down, there's a list of your apps, their associated integration keys, the type of environment the integration keys are valid for, and their go-live status. If you don't see any apps on this page, it may be that you haven't created any, or that you're using a different account, or you're in the production environment. You can also select from a drop-down list of actions next to each app. Select View API Dashboard to open the API Dashboard with a filter set to that integration key. Returning to the Apps and Keys page and scrolling down to the bottom of the page, you'll see two graphs with information about your applications. Clicking on the graph on the left shows you the API Dashboard of your API requests, while the graph on the right shows the API dashboard of the response times. These graphs show the aggregate request and response data for all your apps instead of just one app. The API dashboard displays metrics and information of your account's apps. You can create and apply filters that enable you to select and view the set of API call data that you want. Below the filter edit box is a graphical timeline of aggregated API request or response time data that meet your filter criteria. You can filter for response type, group by user ID, integration key, response type, or HTTP response code, and choose what type of graph to display. Below the graph are up to the 500 most recent API calls made to the DocuSign platform that meet your filter criteria. Clicking View for any item returns a details view. As simple as that, you can get the data you need to track your app performance and troubleshoot issues. If you have questions about how to develop your integration with DocuSign, here are some resources. I recommend checking out the Developer Center How-To Guides, going to Stack Overflow, reaching out to support, signing up for API office hours, or searching the DocuSign developer blog for API Dashboard. Thanks for tuning in. If you're watching from our YouTube channel, please post questions and comments below the video or email us at developers at DocuSign.com.